Today, me and Lucian are going to be going head to head in a tie break tens battle, which we haven't done in a while. Before we start, thank you to Dunlop for sending us these rackets, the SX series, which we've been playing with over the last few weeks in our videos. If you're someone who likes a lot of spin when you play, there'll be a link in the description where you can check out more info about this racket. But without further ado, I think we should get started, right? Let's do it. All right. Okay, so Lucian was up to serve first in this tie break and he unluckily just missed. It was just wide. Um, this was obviously the first tie break we've played in a while, so our serves and returns were not well practiced, so to speak. And most of the points were between zero and four shots, uh, I think it was 70% of points, which is pretty reflective of men's tennis um, in this day and age. So points like that with a, a big serve down, down the body and then Lucian kind of not moving out the way of the return. Is, it, is that how you see it, Lucian? Um, yeah, I think, especially with the backhand, I find it harder when someone does a um, body serve to the backhand. I find it harder to get out of the way. But here, uh, you hit a really good serve. I just couldn't, unfortunately, I couldn't get to it. Nothing I can do. Good serve from you. Um, yeah, I felt my slider serve was, was quite good. Yeah, especially that, yeah. I think it's quite useful if you can switch it up between like a kick and then a slider, especially if you haven't played in a while. Yeah, true. So the returns usually this something that's quite usually takes a lot of practice. Here I got a bit lucky, <laughs> and it also broke my rhythm. I was that would have been four points in a row, and then you might have run away with it. But then he, he pulls it back. Um, now you've got the rhythm and, and the serve, and he puts it exactly where I hate it as well. Backhand body. Um, I couldn't get out of the way either. Yeah, I think um, my return was really strong here. Uh, a lot more depth on that return because I felt like it was a pretty weak serve, to be honest. Yeah, I think the camera angle doesn't really do it justice in terms of like, the speed. It was a lot, you know, it looked a lot faster in real life than it is on camera. Yeah, I agree. But also on, on this kind of um, asphalt surface almost, it's quite useful if you can like kick a serve up, even if it's slow, you can really get get the spin on it, which, which, which can be quite like difficult then to put it in the court. Thoughts on that shot? Mistimed it, didn't get into position. Right, so 5-3 me now, this is a pretty big point, and I missed long, that's not ideal. Um, I think the, the timing in general on the returns is something we both need to work on. But let's see if I can <coughs> hold my serve now, pretty important points. So that's, the, that's like I said with the, with, with the kick serve. It's oh, a good shot. Yeah, I think that's the, the highlight of the match, I think. Yeah, one, definitely one of the best points. Yeah. It was a good lob. I just ma managed to s somehow get up there. And I was surprised that surprised that, that went in. I don't know, sometimes you kind of swing and miss. So 6-4. Oh, big point to keep keep the mini break in there. There's a, there is again the swinger serve out wide. I think that was that was pretty useful today. Yeah, that was a really good shot, really good return. I don't think I put enough on myself, so. Well, it's eight four now. We switched sides. Are you are you gonna come back, Lucian? Seeing oh, you look there. at that! Yeah, there we go. That's a great, great deep ball, and he, he just puts that away. Just as a little extra, even though I think it was maybe going wide. Maybe. <laughs> well, probably, most probably. So yeah. there, switching out, going wide. That's another brilliant return. Yep. And that's another brilliant backhand line. I think what you do there is you keep it low. I think. Yeah. Especially with my flat backhand, I love yeah. keeping the ball low and fast. And as you can well. see, it worked really well. This is a pretty big point as well. If, if, if I win this, I've got three match points. True. Ooh, just I'm getting like... another cheap point. I mean, it was really close. It would have been a yeah. brilliant a return. A few centimetres. Yeah. So, 9-6. A bit of a slower serve. I think that almost caught me off guard a bit. Mm -hmm. oh, I just put it long. I think I almost put too much on that ball, trying to trying to spin it onto the onto the baseline. That's a big serve. That's a big serve. 
So is that in or out? That that was out. No. In the match, I was looking at it. They see yeah, that's so, confirmation. So I think what we decided was just to replay because in the match it, it looks out now, but Lucian wasn't hundred percent sure. So we decided to replay the point. Just yeah. you know. To be I fair. mean. It was one of those points where I kind of knew it was out, but I wasn't 100% sure. Yeah, so the, that corner of the court was a bit slippy, you know, it's a bit of a disclaimer. So, um, yeah, so 9-8, 9-8, eight. Eight. going to do big backhand serve, and I take it 10-8. But I think that was a good match for the first match in a while, and hopefully we can play quite a few more and practice our return, so maybe get a bit more, you know, length on, on the points. So guys, if you enjoyed this video and this kind of style of tie break tens, which we haven't done in a while, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe with bell notifications on if you want to be notified when we post subsequent videos in the future, which also hopefully will be lots more tie break tens.